Gymnastics is my creed. I G C. Um, this is my first time at IGC, so I'm so excited to be here. The girls literally bombarded me, all 400. It was the cutest thing ever. It was so sweet. I almost fell out of my chair. So it means so much to me to be here. I love helping them out. I love being in the gym with them all day, and um, I definitely see myself in them. I see how much they love gymnastics, so it's very exciting and cool for me to be here. When I was younger, I went to a sleepaway camp, and it was called Camp Waikasuda, and my um, aunt and uncle, they owned the camp, and it was a sleepaway camp where you could do everything. It wasn't just for gymnastics, and I loved it. I think it is so great for kids to come to these sleepaway camps. It's a way to bond, meet new friends, and just have a really good time, and I mean, this gymnastics camp is great. They can learn new things, get new skills from different coaches, so it's very exciting, and it's, it's a lot of fun. I could describe myself in three words. Let's see. Um, I guess energetic, crazy, and daring. I like to try new things. <laughs> My favorite part about being here so far is um, just everyone. Everyone here is so sweet. The staff members are, are so nice. I've literally only been here for a day and a half, but they've all welcomed me. They've all been so nice. I feel like we're already great friends, and um, I definitely would love to come back here. And also the gymnasts, they're so sweet, so nice. They're all hard workers, so it's definitely been an amazing experience being here. This past year has been so exciting, and I've definitely surpassed all my expectations. I've, um, I think I've learned this year you can never dream big enough. I've literally done everything and more that I could have possibly imagined. And, of course, doing Dancing with the Stars was so special, so amazing. It was a chance for me to do something different, show everyone you know, my personality. And it was just really fun to do something other than gymnastics. Um, going into London, I mean, I was just so focused, so determined, you know, your whole life you have that one dream and that one goal, and then, you know, when you see the calendar hit 2012, it's, it's finally here, you know, it, it comes so quick, so every day I worked as hard as I possibly could, so every night when I would go to sleep and I was exhausted, I knew I did everything I possibly could. We all live like all over the country, so uh, we do all keep in touch. We have a group message, and we'll all like update each other on little things that are going on. But we all are returning back to the gym, so I'm so excited. Hopefully, next national is not the one in two months, but next year uh, we'll all be competing. So that will be very, very exciting. gymnastics because it never gets boring. There is always something that needs to be worked on. It is so challenging. Um, next, I am really looking forward to getting back in the gym. I was home for about two weeks after Dancing with the Stars and I was in the gym every day. The plan when I was on Dancing with the Stars was just to enjoy my summer and just to relax, but as soon as I visited the gym and I saw all the little girls in there doing conditioning and working out, I wanted to get right back in there. Um, I think the best advice I can give is just, um, you know, besides having fun, because that's so important, it's just to really believe in yourself. Gymnastics, in my opinion, is the hardest sport in the world. It, it's so easy to get discouraged or to let yourself get down, but you have to remember that there are probably going to be more bad days than good days. I mean, training for the Olympics, I can't even tell you how many days there were where I was so disappointed in myself, so frustrated, because... I am a perfectionist, you know, if I fell one time off the beam in a full week, it was like the worst thing ever. So it's just important to remember that the bad days are what make you know what a good day is. You, if you didn't have any bad days, then you wouldn't even know what a good day was. So it's important to remember you're only human. You know, everyone makes mistakes, just have to learn from it and try to have a positive attitude. Hey everyone, I'm Allie Raisman here at IGC. I'm having such a great time with all these amazing gymnasts. I love being here. I definitely recommend that you come here. It is very exciting. All the staff members are so amazing, so nice. It's so much fun. So uh, go to International Gymnastics Camp for more information to see more interviews from other gymnasts.